everybody it's Kelly and I am back again this is my very last layout for 2019 so I'm taking that scripty paper and it's from illustrated faith the advent collection but I have a collection pack so I can't tell you exactly what paper it is the same thing is true about the green paper on the right side that is also from the illustrated faith advent collection so I'm going to mount that scripty paper on that red piece of cardstock which is from color book and you can see that there. And what I'll what I'm going to do here is I'm going to, to get it straight first of all. Just use it in a the way of a frame, but I'm going to extend these two photos and then that 4 by 4 cut apart into uh, all the way across that frame. Sometimes I'll keep it within the frame, this time I'm going to take it all the way across the frame. So I did find that red, that paper with like a little, it's got a little kind of cross in it. That paper is from Bella Boulevard, Merry Christmas, and it's a daily details paper. So I'm going to mount those squares on it and then I'll take that and mount it to this green paper. Now I didn't have enough of the green paper so I just chopped it so that I could actually use it on both sides of this red paper. And that way I have things that are crossing from one side to another. So that red cross paper is on both sides and then the green paper is on both sides. So even though I'm not mirroring my um, my layout here or I'm not using the exact same background papers they still have things in common that make them work as a two-page layout so this story is about a redefined creative advent calendar it was the first time I had ever done this and I don't remember if I told you this or not so when I first got it I took pictures of it as I pulled it out of the mail which is what that picture is and then I put them into a Christmas basket and that's what I pulled them out of each day. And then on the right, I Instagrammed a photo of what I got every day so I would remember it. And then I put them together in a um, collage in the Becky Higgins Project Life app. So that's how I did that. And then um, that Project Life app had many, many more squares than what I actually used, but I just used the first um, 24 of them and then didn't um, and then just chopped off the rest of it is basically what I did so if you don't have the right size don't worry about it all right so I'm mounting that red paper on another one and then I should tell you where that um, cut apart came from let me see if I can find it for you here I don't know that I wrote that down. It is a, it is from the Bella, I think it's from either Bella Boulevard Christmas Cheer or um, the, actually it is from the Bella Boulevard Christmas Cheer. It's one of the um, daily details pieces of um, paper. So then I'm taking an, an uh, it's not really an alphabet. It is actually the word December there. And that is from the Bella Boulevard Chow Chip from the Christmas Cheer Collection. And it's the icon sheet. And then I'm also using like this chipboard heart and the snowflake. And that is from the same uh, Christmas Cheer Collection as well too. I will need to put another word probably up next to December, but I'm kind of playing around with that right now. These tags that I'm using, these gift that gift tag and then that circle gift tag that are at the top and then also at the bottom are both from the Bella Boulevard Oh My Stars gift tags. And then I'm again using that red circle, that red star circle and a snow another snowflake, which is from the uh, Christmas cheer chipboard and then I also have another heart up there and that sticker is from the Christmas cheer treasures and texts which is their big big um, their big sheet then I grab that little Santa sticker which is also from treasures and text and then Combine that with the festive fun arrow, which is from the Christmas cheer trinkets, which is their small sheet of stickers. I don't know that they do those anymore because this is an older collection, but that's where it's from at the time. 
So I'm going to combine these down here to give it a little bit of dimension. And so each of these groupings of embellishment has one of those star, um, one of the star circles in it. Okay, so here is where I'm going to grab that festive fun arrow here. And then I'll just add that little um, blue snowflake here. And that's from the Christmas cheer chipboard as well too. And I'm just playing around with it a little bit there to try to figure that out. Then I'll work on this little um, embellishment cluster. <laughs> I'm having a hard time thinking of words tonight. There's so much going on so fast because I have this timed at three times that it's it's actually getting hard for me to keep up with. So sorry, you guys. <laughs> anyway, so there's that one. Then I had moved the Santa sticker over to this other cluster here. And he's going to join that tag. And then that little phrase that says it's going to be a holly jolly Christmas which is from the Christmas Cheer Treasures and Text as well. And I like the way that all looks together then. And I'm just kind of playing around with how these have to kind of join together. These aren't terribly sticky because they're older. So playing with that a little bit. And then I grab that little other arrow piece that says celebrate there. And that came from the uh, Christmas cheer trinkets, the little sheet of stickers. So I think I was pulling all the stuff that I pulled off of the back of the chipboard there. Okay, so then I went through and I found some words here. That word says ho, ho, ho. Um, and then I'll add one that says toys equals joy over here. Or I'm sorry, that one says festive. And those are from the treasures and text as well. Just pulling words here and there. There's the one that says, nope. Oh, there we go, ho, ho, ho. I'm going to add one that says toys equals joy there because I don't like that space. There we go. That kind of fills up that white space that was above the, the uh, festive fun arrow there. And there I'm, I'm uh, thinking about adding in a star there and a star here. And neither of them ends up staying. <laughs> I decided it was too much that I liked it kind of as it is is right there. So the last thing here is I am not loving just the December there. I think it needs something else there. So I'm looking through my Bella Boulevard alphabets here and I will find an alphabet, which is the Bella Boulevard Chow Chip Amore alphabet in the Amore Macintosh color to do the word fun. And I'll go back when I'm all done and I'll glue these chipboard letters down because the Bella Boulevard chipboard does not stick at all. So there you go, guys. There's just the still shot and a couple of detail shots. Hope you guys are well and I will be back with another layout again soon. Bye, everybody. Mm -hmm.